Hey everyone, welcome back to the place where we test every single mask in the world. Today we are testing masks from India. That's right, a bunch of masks from India, including the CareView mask, which I like. Soft touch box, let's put it in the clamper and go. So a nice color. <laughs> we'll get it. This is a PFE machine, particulate filtration efficiency machine. If you want to find out more, check out that link. Note, we are testing just the fabric today. We are not testing the fit. Both things are important, fit and filtration. So keep that in mind. All right, let's take a look at this. Uh, CareView, careview.in. India site, you can buy these on Amazon. You can tell they really care about their brand. Let's look at the three ply. We bought the 2920 and this is uh, 2992. So they're not showing it on their website. The website's really slow, by the way. Three ply mask, SS, two layers of spun bond, melt blown, spun bond, three layers of filtration, bacterial filtra filtration of 97%, which isn't any American standard. Uh, suitable for non medical purpose. Let's take a look at uh, the box. I like the box. It is a soft touch box. It's got a nice logo on there, Cure View. Bacterial filtration efficiency, 95%. Now remember, BFE does not matter. BFE is huge when, compared, when you're talking about COVID. Um, co it's like 10 times larger than, than COVID is. So we're using a PFE machine. So this number is, may or may not uh, align with what this says. Um, but again, like I always, I feel like this is disingenuous if they're saying, uh, 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 95%. All right. I like the box. Let's open it up. How do I open it? How do I open you? Oh my gosh. These are just all stuffed in here. Okay. Let's take a look. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is not good. Look at that. I can see through it. This is not good. So if you can see through a mask, that means there's probably not melt blown in it. And melt blown is the layer that protects you. This is very confusing. A company that puts their logo actually on the mask doesn't look like they're actually putting melt blown in the mask, which means this thing is not gonna protect you at all. Spun bun, this is the second time I've seen this in India. I have never seen this anywhere in the world. I've not seen this in China, I've seen it anywhere in the world. Spun bun, spun bun. Three layers of spun bun. No melt blown. Wow. That is just shocking to me. To me, that is just, that is just evil. There's their middle layer. Look at it. You can see through it. That's a sign. That's not going to protect you. I should probably stop there. There is zero chance that this is 95% PFE or BFE. This isn't going to block anything. This is a terrible mask. I should stop there. There's no reason. Terrible mask. Do not use this. Full stop, in my opinion. This is not a mask that's going to protect you. Don't use this mask. This is borderline evil, what these people are doing. Um, and shocker, the ear loops are not ideal either. And I'm like, okay, yeah. <laughs> Look at that. This is, what a joke. Gosh. I don't like to... <laughs> I don't like to be negative on a company, but like, I don't like to, maybe, maybe you're watching all my videos and you're like, are you sure what? Um, uh, I don't like to dunk too hard on people. I like to give people the benefit of the doubt. But if you are putting three layers of spun bond and making people and putting 95% on the box, making people think it's going to protect you, you're a bad person. That's it. You're just a bad person. You're lying to people. Um, I'll smell it. We'll see what happens. Why not? Let's just go through the motions here. The ear loops are really small too, by the way. I'm going to call this smell the printed out script for the movie Liar Liar. Get it? It smells like paper and they're lying to you. So if I explain the jokes, are they funnier or worse? I'm not sure. All right. So I'm making a lot of assumptions here because I haven't looked at the screen yet. I haven't looked at to see what the PFE machine is telling us. But I opened the mask and I could see that there's no melt blood in it. So what do you think it's going to be? I think it's going to be pretty bad. Let's take a look. 14%. So 
Surprisingly, not the worst mask we found from India. 14.009%. Worst one was about 10%. Um, I have not seen this level of huckstery. Huckstery? Is that a word? Um, it's actually quite, quite shocking. You know, um, when uh, the crisis first started in India, we had people on the ground who were reaching out saying they needed help. We sent millions of masks, of our masks, for free uh, to India. Actually, it was less than free because we had to pay for the shipping to get it there too. And uh, a lot of folks, um, you know, called us out on that and said like, oh, but we have plenty of masks here. The people on the ground were saying, no, we don't have good quality masks. We need your masks. So we sent the masks. But other people on Twitter and things were saying like, you're just wasting all this money and energy by, by sending these masks there. This is why we're doing it. They were telling us, we had doctors on the ground saying, I don't think these masks will protect us. And they were correct. In my opinion, a 14% PFE is not going to protect you. That's pretty bad. All right. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Going on this little journey with me. We're going to be testing all the masks that we can find in India. If we have masks, uh, we'll put a link to all of our results. If, if we have masks, uh, if, if you have a mask from India that we didn't test, please, please send it to us. I'd love to test it. Thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you on the next test.